step one is to mark uh, where the holes are going to be placed on the bottom of the bucket. And use your drill. First, draw a ring around the bucket about an inch and a half to two inches below the lowest lowest uh, spacer on the bucket. Ring drawn. Then get your utility knife and start cutting the bucket. Stack it. Stack two spacers on top of each other. Make sure the cap is on the top spacer. Get your fan. And draw an outline for where the fan will be. base of the bucket, uh, we want to carve out a hole for the intake fan, and this intake fan should be about three quarters of the way up on the bucket so that it doesn't blow air into your potting bucket. So first, draw a hole for the fan. First measure a piece of mylar for the bottom portion of the bucket. For our five gallon bucket, the dimensions of the mylar that you should use is 14 inches by 38 inches. So the first thing you want to do with your mylar is, is to crumple it up so it reflect, refracts light better inside the bucket. So take your mylar. Tape one end of the mylar. This will be used to attach it to the in inside of the bucket so you can stabilize the mylar as you glue parts of it to the bucket.
use a hot glue gun to glue the mylar to the bucket. Now we're gonna work on wiring up the, the fans so we can connect to a 12 volt uh, power supply. First thing we're gonna do is cut the, cut the connection. Wired into this piece. Positive goes into positive terminals, negative goes into negative terminals. Finally check whether the fans work. We're gonna cut a hole on the lid so that the light can uh, be mounted on top of it. We're going to uh, mount the power supply to the side of the bucket. We're gonna drill some holes and zip tie the power supply to the side, the power cord to the side of the bucket. 